welcome to my channel, Every Day with Jackie. If this is your first time visiting, I hope you'll stay. Consider subscribing and ringing the notification bell so you'll know each and every time that I upload a video. If you are returning, it's good to see you guys as always. So this is part two of my lipstick collection. Um, as I mentioned in a previous video, part one, you guys did indicate that you wanted to see my uh, makeup collection. So we're just kicking things off with my lipsticks. So if you haven't already seen part one, I will have it linked above, but this is part two. Uh, part two, um, I will be swatching my bullet lipsticks and part one, I swatched all my liquid lipsticks. So if you're interested in seeing part two, my bullet lipstick collection, then please keep watching. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and start swatching. I have my bullet lipsticks in these drawers because I don't mind them laying down. I just don't like my lipsticks laying down. So let's go ahead and get started. We'll start with our ColourPop lipsticks. These are all the lipsticks that I have in bullet form by ColourPop. So I don't have that many. So the first one is called Hello Stranger. And this is what it looks like, very deep in color. I know for a fact that I haven't worn this very many times, but let's go ahead and get a swatch. And this is what it looks like. And it's called Hello Stranger. And next up, we have a shade called On Display. Again, this is called On Display. Next up is the shade Foolish. Pretty orangey shade. And this is what it looks like. Very pretty. Again, that's Foolish. Next, we have Liquid Courage. Liquid Courage. And one of my very favorites is called Slow Dance. And this is a velvet blur. Very comfortable on the lips. It's very comfortable. It's so silky. And again, this is called Slow Dance. This is a great, the velvet blur. That's a great formula. And next we have Doing Fine. Doing Fine. Okay, now we're moving to our Too Faced lipstick. And I only have one, and this is in the shade Drunk Dial. And you can see the little peaches on there. Drunk dial. Sir, get out the garbage, please. I still hear you. Lucky. Get out the uh, get out the garbage, sir. <laughs> He's like. This is Drunk Dial. <laughs> oh, that boy of mine. Next, we have a lipstick by Mary Kay. 
um, the shade has worn off. This is an oldie. Sorry, we don't know what it's called. It's probably no longer available anyway. Then another Mary Kay. And this is in the shade Rouge. I had this one first, and I loved this packaging by Mary Kay, but then they went to this little cheap plastic. But I use this lipstick like nobody's business. And I do know this has been discontinued. I, I don't see it on their site anymore. So this is Rouge. And let's see. We have a lipstick by Cargo Cosmetics. And I did get this in my Allure box. And this is in the shade Bombay. I think I smashed it. Yep, I did. Really light. There it is right here. And again, this is in the shade Bombay. And then we have three of these mini lipsticks by, by Pat McGrath. Okay. Um, the three minis. The first one is in the shade Elson. It's a very pretty shade. I'm trying to see if I can swatch over here. Elson. And this right here. Very pretty. Next up, we have the shade Obsessed. That's orange, which is perfect for this time of the year. Obsessed. Did I show you the? And the last one is in the shade Full. Full Panic. Very pretty. It's a pretty pink. Full Panic. Okay, on to the next drawer. Um, let's go with this one. And this is a lipstick by L'Oreal. And this is in the shade Rebel Rouge. And this is what that shade looks like. It's very pretty. Rebel Rouge by L'Oreal. And we have another full size Pat McGrath. And this is in the shade Flesh 3. I don't know why her lipsticks have this little powdery. Maybe that's what keeps them soft. I don't know. Flesh 3. Very creamy. And then I have... I'm such a dork when it... Y'all... I'm such a dork. I'll explain later. I have four, five Black Radiance lipsticks. <clears throat> and you know Black Radiance, uh, their lipsticks have numbers. So this is in the shade 5026. And I have another 5026. I know how that happened because I lost one of them and I bought it again. So this is a very bronzy, metallic looking lipstick. And as soon as I brought it again, I found it. 
And then again, this is 5026. Now this is 5016 and 5016. I brought these this lipstick in two different states. So I didn't even know I had bought this one twice. I just this is the lipstick I bought when we were in Georgia. And then I bought it again a couple of months ago. 5026. Oops. Isn't that a pretty shade of red? Not pretty enough to buy it twice, but. <sighs> okay. Next, this is the last one, and this is 5027. I only have one of these. And again, this is 5027. It's a burgundy like lipstick. Okay, and I have two lipsticks by Anastasia Beverly Hills. The first one is in the shade Rum Punch. This is what her lipsticks look like. Then it has her name on the side. When you open it, it has the A here. And again, this is Rum Punch. Sit right here. Rum Punch. And then we have Stevie. And I'll start right here with Stevie. And here we have Stevie. And I have a lipstick by Revlon in the shade Icy, no, Iced Amethyst. And this is a pearl finish. One of my friends picked me this up for Christmas. Christmas. <laughs> Iced Amethyst. Now we have just three more left, and then we'll move on up. Now this lipstick here, it's a lipstick for real. It's like a lip crayon. And I don't know the brand. Ducey, D-O-U-C-C-E it looks like. And it says it's a matte, relentless matte lip crayon. It's in the shade Winter Berry. And I believe I got this probably in my boxy charm. Now, the thing about this is I cannot sharpen this. I do not have a sharpener big enough for this lip crayon. And I do have a pretty big size sharpener, but it's still not large enough for this. And I thought it would be, but it's not. This is huge. So look how big that is. So, um... It's worn down. I, I really like the color, but I just can't find a sharpener large enough. I don't even know if I'll be able to to get anything off the swatch. I'm going to try to take it off the side. And I did it down here so I could try to get it better. But it's a very pretty shade. I just can't... Oh, here's my lip. Here's my lip brush. I can grab it. I'm going to try to get some out and swatch it with my lip brush. Because like I said, it's a very pretty shade. And I guess I could go ahead and use it that way. Until I can't get any more out. Here it is. Again, this is the shade Winter Berry. And then I have these two lipsticks that are exactly the same. Now the story with this is, 
I think I received this in a boxy charm. And another one of my co-workers at the pharmacy, she was receiving BoxyCharm at the same time. And she said that this was just too dark for her, so she gave it to me. Now this is by the uh, brand Laz Laza. I don't know if that's a Z or an A. I mean a Z or a G. So it's Laza or Laga <laughs> Cloud, uh, Cloud Lips. I can't tell in that fancy script so I don't know if it's a Z or a G and let's see if I can see the shade the shade is called storm this is what it looks like and then I'll go ahead and continue swatching over here and this is what it swatches like and again this is the shade storm very pretty I like that. Okay, so we have one last drawer. And this has my Charlotte Tilbury lipsticks and my Bite Beauty. And then we have my lip liners. So, again, so I don't keep you guys long, we'll go ahead and end the video here. And then in part three, We'll finish up with the lip liners and these lipsticks right here. So again, thank you so much for tuning in to my lip collection video. We're just about done. We'll um, finish it off in part three, and then we'll be all done with the lipsticks. So thank you so much for tuning in to today's video. Please go ahead and give the video a thumbs up if you like these types of videos. Again, if you're not subscribed to the channel, please go ahead and do so. Don't forget to ring the notification bell so you know every time that I upload a video. And remember, you guys are always welcomed and wanted here on my channel. And don't forget, I'm going to keep on filming. So when you see part three, I'll be looking just like this. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching, you guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.